I'm not really doing a do-it-yourself to remove the door panels because I'm changing from the fox red to the black but you got your four screws right here for the driver's side and for the passenger side it's just three uh actually it's four too <laughs> my bad and then you have the door handle right here so and then now uh, uh, buddy uh moving his so stay tuned and you reconnect everything they plug in right here right here and right here if you don't plug that in you won't have um you won't be able to roll your window down you only can do it from the driver's side if that's still plugged in and then uh make sure you plug that in that's for the um the light right down here i believe should be yeah and then plug this into come here all right, door panel's on after some persuasion and a couple of curse words. Same car still. Go ahead, start screwing these. Oh, don't drop it. He's in any soap. Good to go. And then I just need a door clip for this side and I'm good to go, baby. Yes, sir. All right, black door card for the door side now. Ready to go. One, two, three. There you have it. Now it's on. Good old door card. Black. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Hmm. All right, so the rear seat uses a T50 there. There, that's already, uh, that's for the seat belt, but there. And then, uh, same for there. And, uh, there. Right there are the screws. Doing a little vacuuming, but here you see it. Hey, Hector. You're too slow to race with the rest of us. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, hey, Hector. I'm gonna change it. I just did this because if I were to drain the oil what would i use to refill it you know what i mean i ain't gonna use no 5w30 all right back to it all right you can get this one t50 right there i'm right out baby i'm gonna see if i can video this while this is all bent. I'm sure how I like that. Just pry up on this and I come out. There you put your screwdriver right there, boom. Now this needs a good vacuum because this is disgusting. Right here is the final product. All black minus the armrest because I'm gonna do an armrest delete. I kind of wish I never removed the armrest because the back, you can kind of barely see it, but the back has uh, kind of messed up. That makes sense. Right there, see that? Anyways, but yeah. Uh, the only difference between the 08 and 09 is right here, it's kind of, thicker whereas the 08 is not and um it's real easy to remove these it's just lift up and it comes right off so but other than that i really like the black interior and the owner is also happy with the fox red so 
you know, I think it was a good trade. I, gr granted, I still have my aluminum trim pieces and because he didn't want to remove this, which I don't blame him. It was still that uh, wood grain. So classic look and uh, I believe he'll change it eventually. So yeah, I didn't put back in the uh, the AC piece that goes behind here, but eh, it's okay. But other than that, uh, next list things to fix is the awesome parasailing headliner. It looks very uh, good, the black. Some may say, why'd you get rid of the Fox Red Leather? Like one of my buddies messaged me and I told him, hey man, I'm not, it's a little, a little too bright for me. But this is nice. Hey, y'all see it. I'll catch y'all next time. All right, y'all.